Good afternoon. My name is James Farley, and I'm a student with the University of Delaware. And I'm finishing up my project with the personal health management class. And I thought I'd take a few minutes to offer my experience and my thoughts about the class and my overall thoughts and goals of uh, having a healthy lifestyle. Before taking this class, I was working on just going to the gym, eating healthy, and not seeing many changes. So I thought about taking this class with Professor Bowman. And I've learned that it's not just about the gym and eating correctly that will help you have a healthy lifestyle. There's other key factors um, in life that you need to do to uh, have a healthy lifestyle. <clears throat> healthy living starts with you. Uh, I feel like, you know, eating and going to the gym is, is a key role that everybody thinks, but also getting a nice worth of sleep. Um, being stress-free is very important because um, that puts a lot of tax onto your body. Uh, most people think that eating and exercising is the only thing that makes you have, and that's not 100% true. Um, there are other factors, like I said, health to um, have a better healthy lifestyle, and that's stress, time management, and sleep are the number ones that I would feel. Uh, stress puts a lot of strain on your body in different ways, and it's not healthy for your body at all. <clears throat> Seven to eight hours of sleep, um, preferably around eight. Uh, is a good night's sleep for your proper for your body to fun properly function the next day. Uh, if you don't have that sleep, then your body's obviously going to be you know, behind the eight ball and working a lot harder. Uh, time management is uh, is very key, not only in adults but definitely for college students with uh, different classes, different events that you attend, and all that stuff. Time management is very key. Uh, when you get behind in time, you get stressed. Then you're not eating correctly, you're not getting to the gym, you're not exercising. So I think time management is is, is very important. <clears throat> I think people overall can achieve a healthy and, and well-being lifestyle simply just doing daily exercises. And uh, that doesn't mean going to the gym. I feel like if you, you know, just get up and move, uh, go for a walk on your lunch break, uh, that would be very key for you and uh, having a healthy lifestyle. <clears throat> Eating correctly. Um, I've noticed, you know, once I start packing my lunch, I'm starting to eat a little bit better. I'm not going out spending money on junk food, fast food, the Wawa, stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> and that only takes me two to three days a week where I got to meal prep, maybe an hour or two at a time. You know, uh, Sundays I meal prep until Wednesday and then Wednesday until Sunday. Uh, and stress free, I, I like to, you know, kind of keep myself stress-free, free, not let anything bother me, um, because that puts a lot of tax onto your body, and then that throws everything off. <clears throat> During this course with Professor Boom and I, I, I really enjoyed the behavior change contract that we did. Um, my goal was to drop weight or body fat percentage. Um, I thought that was going to be easy. It, uh, it was a lot easier to write it down on a piece of paper than it was to do. Uh, I'm so far. I'm happy with some of my results. I've definitely noticed change, you know, in my body, you know, body fat percentage wise. Uh, older shirts are fitting. Um, older pants are fitting a lot better. Um, so that's definitely a good good for me. I've uh, kind of maintained the same weight, but uh, like I said, changed my body fat percentage. So it definitely definitely can tell a difference. <clears throat> you know, going to the gym 40 hour 40 hours. Wow, it's a long time. 40 minutes a day uh, was 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 miserable uh, for the first week or two. It sucked. Uh, but now I feel a lot better. Every time I go there to do 40 minutes of cardio, just watch a little TV show on the gym TV, and next thing I know it's over. Um, and slight changes like that have made me feel a lot better. Um, getting night, better night's sleep, uh, not worrying about a lot of stuff, not eating out. Not going out to the bar late um, <clears throat> and stuff like that. I think people in the world, if they uh, can, for the world to have a better lifestyle and healthy life, uh, would just be small changes that they could do, and that will help them in the long run. <laughs> Muhammad Ali once said, uh, "I hate every every minute of training, but I said don't quit. Suffer now and live the rest of your life as a champion." Um, that's really not a health motivation quote, but I think that's very good, uh, when it goes to somebody going to the gym and not liking the gym. Um, so, uh, that's what kind of motivates me to get into the gym. Thanks.